I got you a present. Pink panties. Put them on. Put them on. Do it. But okay, turn around. No. Then. Like, put them on. Put them on. Welcome to Rank Bank. Now, over the years, throughout time, mankind has thrown up some very questionable groups of people. From serial killers such as Jeffrey Dahmer and Ted Bundy, to far-right political parties like the Nazi Party, to TikTok creator houses like the Wave House. But today, we're taking a look at a group potentially far worse. We're taking a look at Facebook Facebook pranksters. Admittedly, I may have gone a little bit overboard there in the introduction. It was a joke. There's no way that Facebook pranksters are as worse as the Wave House. Now, when it comes to Facebook pranksters, there's one guy that reigns supreme, and that guy is Julius Dean, Facebook magician. Facebook magician. It takes a shine off when you have to say Facebook before a job title. It's like Instagram model, are ya? All right, love. I'm Jack, mate, YouTube comedian. Today's video is actually sponsored by Display. Displays, if you didn't already know, are high quality metal posters like this that you can buy online and get delivered straight to your door and then hang up on your wall without the use of hammers, nails, sellotape, glue, blue tack, cement. As you can see, Display have got loads of designs to choose from. I've got this one, celebrating a draw. I went for a Ricky Gervais one as well, which is a bit creepy, come to think of it. And finally, I went for this Post Malone one, which I think is my personal favorite. All you've got to do is click the link down below, head over to the Display website and this absolutely thousands you can choose from. At the moment as well, there's loads of different discounts you can get. I'll put them up here so you can see which works for you and your budget. I'll quickly show you how easy they are to put on the wall as well. So, all displays come with one of these magnetic leaf papers that after cleaning your wall, you can attach to your wall, whack a magnet on the back of the poster, and bang, it's all done in about 10 seconds. It literally is that easy. Oh, and also, for every display you buy, display plant one tree in Africa, thanks to their partnership with Trees of the Future. Julius Dean, Facebook magician. Let's have a little look on his Facebook, shall we? What better place to start, Londoner? Geezer. He's a magician, vlogger, and social media entrepreneur. Not sure that's how you spell that. Self-proclaimed entrepreneur cannot spell the word entrepreneur. Right, he has a website as well. Let's have a look at the website, shall we? London-born magician Julius Dean is known for mixing mind-blowing magic with hilarious comedy. Hilarious. Comedy. I simply cannot wait for some mind-blowing magic mixed with some hilarious comedy. The secret hand in a bucket prank gone wrong. What on earth is possibly gonna go wrong? <laughs> I'll tell you what's gonna go wrong. 370 million fucking views. That's what went wrong. That's what went wrong. Why does he get so many views? Is it the mind-blowing magic? Is it the hilarious comedy? I don't know. But I think it might have something to do with... I can't see any common theme throughout there. Fiona, how do you spell misogyny? Now, I'm not gonna sit here and claim that Julius Dean's pranks are fake. But how on earth are those two girls on the bench not seeing him from their peripherals or hearing him just behind them? I mean, he touches one of their fucking hands at one point. Look at that! I mean, he's not even trying at this point, is he? There's a hole in the bottom of his bucket. Hilarious comedy. Look at his face. Look at his face. Fuck me. Reminds me of my face the moment Belle Delphine gave me the used butt plug. Yeah! Listen to that. that. How are you not hearing that? Why is he telling the cameraman to shush? <laughs> Man's not made a peep, bless him. Julius, you're the one who's fucking strutting about knocking up a big art attack, mate. This is Art Attack. Sorry, 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 I can't get my head round out there not hearing that. He's just locked half a ton of fucking Harry Bow in a bucket. Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh, hey, 
I'm going to show you a magic trick. All right. I mean, over here, if that curly haired twat snuck up to an English woman in the park and jumped out of nowhere and went, oh, I'm going to show you a magic trick, the only thing he'd be getting is a bottle of Lambrini to the jaw and a fucking restraining order. I don't know what we're doing with this, but that's not scaring anybody. Ooh. No, 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 that's, 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 not, that's not the magic trick, right? Look, okay. Chloe, stick your hand inside. Okay. Yeah, stop. Okay, I get it. He's gonna scare them with the real hand through the bottom of the but 317 million views. Do you feel anything? <laughs> Probably not the first time he's had to ask a girl that. <laughs> look, look, look. Okay. Look, do you see what's happening? Yes. Do you see what's happening? Ah! Yes. Julius Dean is known for mixing mind-blowing magic with hilarious comedy. <laughs> Mind blowing magic with hilarious comedy. Oh, so funny. Because I'm putting my Instagram at Julius Dean on private in 24 hours. Oh shit! Shit! I bet I've missed out on that now. I bet I've missed that deadline. This video's been out months as well. Let's have a little look, shall we? Oh, that's weird. That's very peculiar. He said he was going to make his Instagram private, so we better fuck, but there's still... I mean, he must have just forgot. He must have slipped it. I better remind this guy, actually. Hi, mate. Bit awkward, but I think you might have forgotten to put your Instagram on private. Haha. <laughs> Kiss. I think now I've reminded him in the coming hours or days we will see his Instagram go on private because it won't just be a dirty lie to try and get followers. He wouldn't do that. It's not in his nature. And now I've reminded him, you don't have to as well. I mean, it might help. It might help. Who knows if we all went over and just remember. But I don't, I don't, I don't want to encourage that. All right? Okay, I think it's time now to take a look at one of the many, many videos in which Julius has carefully and respectfully chosen to use an image of a half-naked woman in his thumbnail. How about this one? Simply titled, Spread Your Legs. I got you a present. Pink panties. Put them on. Put them on. This is a brilliant magic trick that was shown to me one day by Sam Pep. Calm down a bit, Julius. Yeah, it's a bit forceful, son. Wait, what did he say? <laughs> he said, put them on. It's, this is cool. Is it cool? Is it? I'm 27. Maybe I've lost what cool is. Maybe I never had it. I already have a pair of panties Trust on. Trust me. Put the panties on. This is a really cool magic trick. Put them on. You only need to take a quick look at his profile pictures to understand that the guy just oozes cool. Look at that. Samuel L. Jackson must be shitting himself. You are one of a kind. You're not wrong there. You're not wrong. Anyway, back to the rapey bit facey B. Facebook. Slip of the tongue. Put them on. <laughs> With hilarious comedy. Do it. Do it, trust me. I mean, I can't claim to know Julius. I don't know what he's like as a person. He might be absolutely lovely. However, the way in which he says the phrase, do it, trust me, definitely seems like he said that before. Do it, trust me. I put the panties on. You have to, no, no, what? <laughs> do it! But okay, turn around No, then. put them on. What? Anyway, let's see where he ends up. Hopefully on a list. Okay, now, lift them up. Beautiful, okay, do a spin. A spin. Yeah, okay, great. <laughs> Where's this going? Yeah, Julius. Where's this going, pal? Trust me, this is gonna be cool. So very, very cool. Okay, I'm Fantastic. Gonna... Okay, put one one on there, one on there, and one on there. Now what we're gonna do is you've got to spread your legs. Right? Yep. Another one? What on earth is this magic trick going to be? No, this is cool. This is cool. Okay. Legs up. Legs up, legs up. Sorry. Okay. Hold the ball like this. Right, you're gonna put the ball. Where am I? Yep, hold on to it. Okay, pull the panties up to here. Yep. What's going on? Okay, quick game. After this sentence, I want you to pause this video, right? And I want you to comment down below the word prediction and then followed by what you think the magic trick's actually gonna be. Because at this point, I've got no fucking idea. Uh, your guess is as good as mine. Pause and comment now. Okay, brilliant. There we go, let's move on. I'll look forward to reading them as soon as this video's out. Put the ball in there like this. Yep, okay. You're gonna pull it back, but keep holding on to it. Pull it back like that, yes. Okay. Okay, on the count of three, you're gonna let go. Okay, pulling, 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 pulling. Yeah, I'm pulling. One, exactly, yeah. two, three, let go. It's a slingshot. Oh, piss off. It's a slingshot. Julius Dean is known for mixing mind blowing magic with hilarious comedy. <laughs> mind blowing magic with hilarious comedy. It's a slingshot. Hilarious comedy. Check my Instagram at Julius Dean for more magic with the stuff. Right. 
As I said at the start of the video, I think his pranks are fake as fuck. That's my opinion, you can have your own. And I certainly think he's a massive cringe bag. The wettest of yogurts, if you will. But one thing I can't speak about is what he is like as a person. He might be absolutely lovely, who knows? I think it'd be easier for me to confirm or deny whether these pranks are fake had I actually been in one. Do you know what I mean? Had I actually experienced it myself. If I was somebody like, I don't know, Madison Willow, who just so happens to be in a lot of his videos. Madison Willow could probably vouch for somebody like Julius Dean, couldn't she? Let's hear from her. Let's see what she's got to say. It was all an act. Everything in those videos is fake. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Everything was staged. My happiness, totally fake. Ooh. Julius, he's fake. This is awkward. He just bashes me online and says I'm a slut, says I'm like a terrible person, and says that I'm ugly, and I'm just sitting here like, what did I do to you? Basically, he says that we stopped working together because I'm a porn star. I actually don't know if these claims from Madison are real or not. This is a video that's been on YouTube for three years. But if what Madison's saying is true, and Julius did stop working with her because she's a porn star, then I find that a little bit hypocritical. And to show you what I really mean by this, I need to show you the Julius Dean classic pillow fighting with drunk people. In which this girl, in the thumbnail, seemingly has a as the knockers out. So let's find out what this absolute classic could possibly entail from the man himself. Okay, so again, it's portrayed to be this real thing. Julius is just running around London, hitting people with pillows, willy-nilly, starting these crazy pillow fights. And because of the thumbnail, we know that at one point, he's gonna knock some girl and the boobs are gonna fall out. So with that said, let's get to the money shot, if you will. I feel rank even saying it. Now, I think by this point in the video, we've all got our own opinions on whether or not we think these pranks are fake. I don't think you have to be a f***ing genius to work it out. However, you can literally see <laughs> from two angles the moment that this girl removes her top manually with her hand for the money shot. Julius, mate, if you're going to fake it, don't show it from two different angles in slow motion. Look at that. I'll pause it here. You can literally see she's holding it. Also, if that wasn't enough proof that these videos are just... Just drivel piss. I've done a little bit of research and this woman is actually a famous porn star who goes by the name of Jasmine James. I've done a little bit of research. All right, Jack. Now you may be thinking, Jack, are you sure she's a famous porn star? She might just look a little bit like Jasmine James. But if we do a little side by side of the girl in the video and the porn star Jasmine James, I also just so happen to have the same sexy alien tattoo on the same part of their right thigh. So if the claims that Julius Dean did stop working with Madison Willow because he found out she's a porn star, it's a little bit hypocritical because he seemingly hired one to get her tits out for the thumbnail of his video. So there we go, that is me cementing Julius Dean firmly into Rank Bank. This series is all about showcasing some of the cringiest content on the internet and I think we've firmly done that in today's episode. Hit that thumbs up button, it does really help me out. However, if you didn't like this video and you hate me and you love Julius Dean and you want to give me one of them, go for it. Exercise your right to call me a mug. <laughs> Please make sure you subscribe to the Jack Mate channel. Thank you very much for watching. I'm gonna love you and I'm gonna leave you. I don't love you. I don't know you. I just want everyone to know that Julius Dean is not who you think he is. He is not the lovely, sweet, charming guy that he portrays himself as. He is a hilarious comedian who also just so happens to know mind blowing magic. <laughs> You'll be blowing your merch too much. Beans and burgers. You'll be blowing your merch too much! Beans and burgers.